Huawei's Honor sub-brand has just announced the successor to one of their most competitive mid-range devices, the Honor 7X. Stepping up its class factor with an all-metal body and a new 18x9 display, Honor manages to shave off $50 from the 6X's original $250 price and deliver a more premium-looking device while doing it. Ditching the plastic accents of the 6X, the Honor 7X is now constructed completely of aluminum, an appreciable upgrade to the look and overall in-hand feel. It's a light device, but it feels solid and looks like the higher-end device is selling for double the price. Adding to this classier image is the 18x9 display, which tucked into this mid-size frame creates an 82.9% screen-to-body ratio, the highest at its price point. Clocking in at 5.93 inches, this nearly 6-inch screen carries a 2160x1080 display, which due to its aspect ratio, will naturally have some formatting hurdles to overcome. Thankfully, Honor adds some simple software to make formatting easier. Instead of having to go into the settings to either stretch or box in a particular app, the OS will simply prompt you for your decision when you first open it and remember it thereafter. Speaking of the OS, Emotion UI 5.1 still has a rather iOS-y vibe, but it still looks good and offers neat features like AppTwin, which allows users to log into multiple accounts on the same app. The mid-range Kirin 659 processor packed inside seems to keep things moving quite swiftly. Perhaps a benefit of being manufactured by a sub-brand of the same parent company, this SoC more than does its part to make this $200 phone feel like anything but. Using the phone is a prompt and pleasing experience from the second, or rather split second, you tap the fingerprint sensor. Immediately conjuring the home screen, the swift responsiveness continues in navigating the phone and switching apps. The 7X likely won't crush any benchmarks, but finding issues with its day-to-day -day use will be hard. Dual cameras make a return on the 7X, and although they look much better than before, the functionality remains the same. Comprised of 16 and 2 megapixel cameras, the dual camera setup uses a wide aperture mode to create bokeh on portrait subjects. Relying heavily on software, we hope to find this implementation more refined than on the 6X, as although we found it fun, execution left a bit to be desired in its previous incarnation. Honor did mention that phase detection autofocus has been improved though, increasing shutter speed by 40%. The front-facing camera clocks in at 8 megapixels and is capable of 1080p video, which is unfortunately the same resolution cap for the 16 megapixel main sensor. Honor 6X was a fierce mid-range competitor last year, but mainstream success in the US seemed to elude it. Turning in welcome aesthetic upgrades with quick internals and the lauded 18x9 thin bezel implementation, it appears to be well prepared for this year's battle. Selling for $200, it's hard to see many devices outdoing the 7X at this price point. Perhaps all that's needed is a slight marketing push for the Honor 7X to steal the US hearts it may rightfully deserve. Stay tuned for our full review coming at you shortly. I'm Corey Gaskin with Phone Arena. Thanks for watching.